Good day everyone. This is uh, another video on the Genesis Evo scan tool with the 4.0 software. Um, I'm bringing you this video today uh, to inform those who may be thinking of buying one and who may also have one or just recently purchased one that there is a slight glitch in the machine or in the computer but don't be alarmed because it's a very very easy fix and what happens is is the tool will lock up if you enter into the file check system I'm gonna power it on right quick and what happens is, is the tool freezes up and if you shut it down improperly uh, when you cut the machine back or the, the computer back on um, it will have a solid window that reads an error message and to correct this you will have to use your memory card with the memory card reader and re-download the software and go through the very very easy steps it's like 10 steps all together and it's very easy to fix and I'm going to show you exactly what happened and what I did that caused my um, tool to lock up uh, of course when you go when you buy any piece of equipment you should always know how it works inside and out so when you get it yes you should play around with it to look at all the features and see how it is that they work and what I did one of the things I did was I went to system setup and I went into there and I was messing around looking at the, the different features as far as the brightness, the colors and etc. things like that and I scrolled down to this button that says file system check and I clicked it so apparently what it does is it checks all the files on your memory card to see if any has been corrupted or if you need any updates and what happened was there's a screen that comes up when you do this and it's going to inform you that you know don't cut off the power on or, or, or unplug the computer or else uh, file corruption may appear it's going to be an all white screen with just blue writing and basically it's going to read um, after it, it, it should only take five minutes for it to do this now I noticed that mine took all night and half for the next day and obviously I knew something wasn't right with it so I shut it down cut it back on it appeared to be working and then all of a sudden this white screen shows up and it reads a message that says improper shutdown detected please do not remove power or cut the power off of the tool as corruption may occur checking file system this may take five minutes now if you shut it down after you click this file system check tab and then you cut it back on it's going to freeze up on you and that error message is going to take up the whole window what I just read off and this is only for the Evo 4.0 that has 2010 domestic and Asian software already downloaded now once again don't panic it's a real easy fix what you're going to do is uh, turn the machine the turn the computer off you're going to take the memory card out of the side of it here the memory card is in there and you're going to place it into the card reader as well as um, take the card reader and put the USB cable in it you should have your NGIS software lo downloaded on your computer this version or higher the 8.0.405 the or higher this one came with the kit any good kit should come with this with this CD-ROM you're gonna take the memory card you're going to put it into the card reader, plug it into a USB port, and you're going to hit the update tool icon on your desktop. 
once that is done it's going to take at least about less than 10 minutes it says it takes 10 minutes but it took like actually five minutes or less maybe three minutes for it to load uh, the new software once you do this is normally it wants you to download any updates from the internet but this will be the only case that you do not download uh, any updates from the internet you just want to reformat the card so that um, everything will be taken off and reloaded again and the fix is on the computer OTC is aware of this problem and I found this fix by typing in OTC Genesis file check on a Google search and OTC had a link on there that uh, was a service bulletin about this particular problem so they are aware of it now once you download the software and the card reader is inside the USB port you have like 10 easy very easy simple steps that the computer is going to do on your desktop and you're going to remove the USB cable with the card reader as well as with the software card still in the reader take the card out of the reader reinsert the card back into the side where it goes underneath this tab and then you're going to power up the device and it's going to take you through some real simple steps well all you will have to do is just hit the enter button right here at least four or five times to reload all the software back onto uh, the scan tool once this is done it takes uh, approximately 20 minutes just to do this whole fix it's real easy it's real simple so if anybody has bought uh, a Evo uh, a Genesis Evo with the 4.0 domestic and Asian 2010 software and it appears to be locking up and you have this message about the file corruption system uh, showing up this will solve that problem it's real easy fix uh, you can go to Google and type in Genesis Evo file system and like the second link you'll see is a service bulletin from OTC telling you how to fix this problem um, once you get through going through the sequences of pressing enter on the tool um, that's it it'll, it'll go right back to the original screen right here which is your application manager screen it's going to show right back up to that and you'll be good to go and ready to get back out there and uh, get some repairs did thank you for listening and that's it